Hello and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm kind of excited because we are, okay, so my son's birthday is tomorrow and so I am doing like, hi babies. <laughs> I'm gonna do like a little vlog, kind of like a weekend vlog because it's Friday. Um, just kind of sharing that process of decorating and everything, all the planning and prep has been going on forever, it feels like. Um, and then the party, this is, I like to share this, but also I like to have it for like my home memories. So that's what I'm doing right now is I'm prepping. It's nine o'clock in the morning. I'm drinking coffee and I've got my coffee, but I'm also making some sweet tea, um, and cleaning the big old jug. This is my mom's and it's like super old. So I'm just like cleaning it, um, letting it soak. But anyways, it's a little bit of a mess as you can see, but I'm purposefully not cleaning that right now because it's just gonna continue to get like that. Um, so I'm gonna tackle that probably tomorrow morning. Anyways, the secret to some good Southern sweet tea is you wanna do a pinch of baking soda to help um, cut some of the bitterness. Um, and this is 16 cups of water that I'm getting to a boil and then I'm gonna do eight tea bags. I like to tie them together just so that it makes it easier to like retrieve them. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna have to do this twice to get a decent amount in that pitcher. So far I have put up like the little backdrop base um, and I'm gonna work on like the balloon arch, which is gonna go there to there. Um, and then I'm gonna have like a giant number three balloon right there and I have balloons that say choo-choo that are gonna go across. Um, and then this is going to be the food table. Um, so yeah, I've, I've just got a lot of work to do today. Not to mention that the house is a mess and needs to get like picked up. I'm washing the bedding right now. Just trying to get all the things done. My lists are like a mile long. So, we, well, for a couple of reasons. Hold on. All right, I wanted to prop my phone up for a second. I put a lot of time and effort into my son's birthday parties, um, even though he's so young. One, because I genuinely do enjoy doing that. I'm a planner by nature. Um, I'm a creative person. So it brings me a lot of joy to do that. I'm watching my water because it's just about to the point where I want to add the tea bags. Um, but then also like, I like going over the top for my son for things like this because that's what my mom did growing up and it always made me feel really special. Um, obviously to each their own. Like you don't have to go over the top to give your kid a great birthday party. Like, it's totally not necessary. That's what I like to do. Um, so yeah, I, and I get really anal about how my house needs to look for the party because I host them here at my home. And so I feel like my home needs to look like a model home. Clearly it does not right now, I've got a lot of work to do. Um, because I'm gonna have like, you know, 16, 18 people here. Um, like lingering in my home and like looking around. And so I just wanted to look nice. <laughs> um, yeah, so I just kind of want to skip that little bit of a disclaimer because I feel like if you get it, you get it. And if you don't get it, you're like, why is she like putting so much effort into things that her three-year-old is not gonna pay a ton of attention to, you know what I mean? So now you know. All right. Um, I think I need to get ready to put these tea bags in. So, and I obviously need to pull myself together. Oh, the other reason I wanted to say that I'm like really trying to do a bunch of stuff right now is, um, my son's birthday is tomorrow and so is his party. And I don't, I don't want the entire day to be party prep and we're not actually spending time with him and his birthday leading up to the party time. You know what I mean? Like that's not fair to him on his actual birthday. So today we're going to take him to a really cool PARK. Um, and then I'm just trying to get as much done as possible so that tomorrow we can hang out a little bit and play. I'm still going to be getting a lot done and my mom's going to be up here helping and playing with him and I'm giving him lots of attention and stuff. So I just want him to feel special the whole day through. Not overlooked because I've got a to-do list a mile long. So anyways, I need to get this tea going. 
All right, so you might not be able to hear me because my box fan is going because it's hot today. Um, but we went to the park and I will insert some footage here because they have like touch a truck. I think the only thing I filmed was a helicopter thing, so I'll show that. There's my trusty box fan, the source of the noise. Um, right now I'm sitting on my bedroom floor wrapping birthday presents because Andrew is napping and our house is really small so there's not a ton I can do. I keep checking making sure <laughs> he's staying asleep and his door is shut. So I have finished dropping the presents and finished most of the backdrop. All right, so here's what I've done. I did assemble the like balloon garland. It's not perfect, but I did it by myself and it's really hard to do one of these by yourself. Um, and then the choo-choo balloons, which half of which will just not stay inflated no matter what I do. So here's to hoping it all stays together. See, like I have two white ones beside each other. I just, it's really hard to finagle all by itself. And actually it's like coming out. I'm gonna have to fix it. Oh, so stressful to do alone. All right, the sweet tea is made. The lid will not fit on it when it's in the fridge. And it will be full when we add the ice tomorrow. And then I chopped up a bunch of mini cucumbers. And yeah, that's where I'm at. <laughs> all right, so you can see I've made a lot of progress over here. I guess we're eating on the couch tonight and tomorrow until the party. <laughs> I've already set the table. Let me show you. All right, so I've got everything situated um, with like utensils and everything that we'll need for tomorrow. And I will show more details of this tomorrow, probably when it's like all said and done and finished. And the coal is the cupcakes, which we're picking up tomorrow as well. Um, house is still a disaster, in case you were wondering. But I did set up um, a little like sign the book station and just like a little choo-choo sign and oh look there's the bathroom we still need to clean <laughs> so yeah i don't know what we're doing for dinner maybe take out because it's after five and i was gonna have like some frozen food but i'm really wanting some takeout so we'll see also washing laundry right now the bed is still unmade because i haven't taken them out of the dryer and made the bed yet so i need to hustle I've been hustling all day, but I still feel like I need to hustle more, so fun times. All right, let me turn off this because Andrew just left with Trevor to go run a couple errands and pick up our to-go food. Um, I'm slowly picking up. I just deep cleaned the sink and I am going to pick up all of this mess in the living room right now and um, vacuum the couches. <laughs> And probably Swiffer. Unfortunately, my son got popsicle on the carpet that has dried in and the stickiness all over the floor, which that part's easier to clean. So anyways, that's what I'm gonna do right now. I don't remember the last time I checked in. I've kind of crashed a little bit. It's like 8 p.m. and I was just responding to some emails and doing a little bit of work. Um, it looks pretty good, right? So like, the house is mostly clean. We have to do things like clean the guest bathroom, um, and set up all of the outdoor stuff tomorrow, like the canopies and the tables and chairs outside, um, and decorate a little bit outside. And then I need to blow up the helium balloons tomorrow, um, which there's not a ton. I think I'm doing like not a lot. Um, do I 
have to make anything tomorrow? I don't think I really have to, like, make anything food-wise. I just need to assemble a few other things. Because um, I asked my mom to bring deviled eggs because her deviled eggs are so good. Um, and my in-laws asked if they could bring something, so they're bringing some macaroni salad. So that has been helpful because I haven't really had to make a ton of food. Um, and then, you know, we need to, like, pick up the dog poop in the backyard. And, um, just random little things like that. Wipe down the kitchen counters, clean the stove top, you know, like, after breakfast. And all that jazz. So, I'd say we're doing pretty good and I'm really happy with that because... I don't want to run around like a chicken with my head cut off tomorrow and not actually be able to like hang out with the angel on his birthday. You know what I mean? All right. So anyways, I'm going to get off here because I'm tired and crashing and yeah. <laughs> See you tomorrow on Angie's birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Day to you. Happy birthday to Andrew. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Can I have a big hug? Since our table is all set up for the party, he's eating his little breakfast on the couch. What you got for your birthday breakfast? Bacon. Bacon. What else? Blueberry pancakes. Blueberry pancakes. And the blueberries. Too. And the blueberries too. You already ate those, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Yummy. It's birthday day and he's about to open his presents. Here we go. Could it be? Did you find your presents? You can open, open them. It. Turn it over. Flip it over. There you, you go. go. Now you see the flaps? Mm -hmm. Good job. Pull it up. Yeah. There you go. Good job. Pull that out. Yeah. Could it be mobile? Could it be? It's Maybe. probably a good guess. You are your mother's child. Huh? Said so he sounds exactly like me when he says stuff like that. All right, buddy. Oh, what do you got? I got books. How many books? That's what he saw. He got that. Two. He saw. Three. Six books. Ooh. Okay, this is so okay. This got twice books in there. I don't know. Is it? Mm-hmm. That's we have to out. That'll be fun later when it's like, hmm, could it be a new oh, tie? <laughs> Andrew, I'm surprised it's not okay. like Wow, wow, that looks super cool. That's a really fun book. Okay, oh, that one's really heavy. <laughs> Alright, the flaps are on the... There you, go. there you go. You see the flaps? It's a very heavy box. You got a bicycle too? <laughs> I think you just saw it. Did you just notice the bicycle? Do you know how to get on it? Here, I'll hold it still. Put your butt on here. There you go. Yeah. 
There you go. And now you just move your feet. Just like that. You walk with your feet. Yeah, can you walk with it? There you go. Just like that. Wow. Nice, dude. What color is your bike? Black and blue. And look. Yeah. What's on it? What's on the bike? Is it a big red bow? Did we find that yesterday? You didn't even know what it was going to be for. It's the red bow we found at the grocery store. All right, let's go finish opening your presents. See how they're all connected? You can they're make magnets. shapes. See, look, look. Look, this gets. Yeah. Yeah, can you connect them together? See, they connect like that. Mm -hmm. Isn't that so cool? Yeah, good job. Mm -hmm. All right, now I'm going to try and do this in the yard. I don't know how hard it's going to be. There it is. You're going to go get some more farm animals? So we're building, we're trying to build some things in this book, but I don't think we have quite all the pieces for it. But we built like a little farm. And now he's getting his farm animals to put in there. I still look like a little bit of a hot mess, like a lot of a hot mess, but like I'm going to be doing so much today. I don't want to get sweaty and gross, you know, after I've already showered and gotten ready. So I'm delaying that. Good job. Until um, I'm done with most things. So I filled up the helium balloons. Trevor is doing the canopies right now. Um, my mom should be here in like 45 minutes with the cupcakes and the balloons from Party City. Okay, this is not the greatest angle, but I'm in the middle of doing my hair. Um, Trevor is trying to not be Andrew. Not going the greatest. I think he's like excited for his party and he's also being very like three years old today. The manager. Um, I think I'm done decorating. I just have to finish getting ready and then I'm going to put out some of the food, I think. All right, I think we are just about done, just about party ready. Party's in just under 45 minutes. My mom's been here most of the day. My dad just got here. So I'm gonna show what we've got set up for now before it gets all busy. So here's the all aboard banner that I made. And then we've got some birthday balloon bouquets. And then, okay, so here's the food situation. So this is hot dogs, which Trevor is grilling now. It's a little, got a little bit pushed aside. And then eggs, my in-laws are bringing macaroni salad. And then um, it's our fruit ranch for the veggies. Chugga chugga, choo choo. There's the drink station. I need to put some ice in the diesel fuel and some more ice in the wet your whistle. And then here's the cupcakes and toppings. Here is the finished banner. Cute, cute, love it. Here's our little gift stand. Put that there. And then, um, just a couple little touches here. So this is like a sign the book thing. And then I'll go show you outside. So it's super windy and it keeps trying to blow the stuff around, but I did like trains all along. 
and some happy birthday balloons. And there's supposed to be two big balloons over there, but they have, I need to fix them. So I'm pretty happy with how everything turned out. Had a little bit of fiasco with my shirt. <laughs> oh, but everything's good. Everything's good. I think everything that I can physically get ready is ready. Um, just doing like a quick walk around. It's not perfect. Like you see, the, it's got stuff on the top of my dresser. So, you look at me. Wow. Yeah, that's for when we open up presents, okay? Yeah, can I show you, can I see your shirt? Can you put your hands up in the air? So I can see your shirt? <laughs> Look at all that trash. Wow, I don't think I filmed like anything. Um, I, hold on, let me sit down. I don't think I filmed like anything during the party. Um, it went well, he loved it, he had a blast. I um, didn't shut the door all the way. He had a blast, he loved it. His little friends came and like they had so much fun. Um, it felt like it went really fast. Like we ate dinner and then had cupcakes and opened presents like basically simultaneously. Um, and then the boys played because he had his two little friends. Um, yeah, it was, it was a good day. It was went by fast. And thankfully, he didn't get, like, too, too much, which is always nice. Um, you know, as a parent. Like, you want your kids spoiled. But also, it's nice to not get a bunch of stuff. <laughs> so, um, we're excited. He said every day we ask, like, what was your favorite part of the whole day? And he said, my favorite part of the whole day was opening presents, which is to be expected. I don't think he had dinner. Like, he had two popsicles and three cupcakes. <laughs> so if that's not how you spend your birthday, then where are you at? Anyways, um, we took down the canopies and the tables and chairs and um, did, like, minimal cleanup. Mostly just the stuff that gets thrown in the trash and... Um, I'll probably leave the backdrop up for several days and we'll figure out where all the new stuff goes tomorrow and take it from there. So, sorry I didn't film a ton. I really wanted to film more. It's just the day got away from me, the time got away from me, um, and I enjoyed spending time with like my family and friends. So we laughed and talked and had a good time. So, anyways, thank you so much for watching and tuning in. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel because there's going to be a really fun little series coming up here in a little bit. Um, and yeah, I think that's all for now. I am sore and exhausted and I'm really hoping Andrew sleeps well tonight because I hope I do too. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye!